Hey, Michael, it's Scott Walker. Uh, it was really nice meeting you today at BNI, so look forward to talking to you. Um, using this website just as a general help and kind of show you what's going on. So, uh, you know, Google, the biggest thing that they look at is content on a website, and they want 1,500 to 2,000 words of content on the homepage, and it looks like this one's lacking, but it still looks like it's doing pretty well for what it is. Um, and I'll show you in a second on the analytics, but they want buyer intent keywords associated with your content as well, which is usually like, a, you know, vet late in Utah or something like that. Um, it has a service and also a location. And the cool thing is if, if it's done correctly, um, the images could be saved correctly. So this is home mountain West veterinarian split specialist. Um, that could, you know, if you add Utah to it, or if you add it to, you know, the, the local area, that could count as content as well because it's embedded behind the photo. So that tool I use that shows me analytics is right here. Um, and pretty much your DR and UR is the strength and trust that Google has for your website. And you want this on a scale, it's on a scale of 100, but you want this balanced and continuously moving up. Um, you're at 19 and 15, which is a pretty good uh, ratio for you. Um, and that's due to your backlinks and referring domains. And if you don't know what a backlink is, it's when one website links to another website via a clickable button or text. But not all backlinks are created equal, so you do want to make sure you stay within your industry and also location whenever possible. And it looks like um, the, this website's getting indexed for 760, 31 keywords. Um, and if you look here, most of these are just its name, Mountain West Vet. There's a thousand searches a month. They're in the second position, and they're getting roughly 376 uh, traffic to the website because of that keyword there. Same thing, Mountain West Veterinary Specialists, 450 searches, first position, 155. So you can kind of see that depending on um, how much volume will generate uh, and what position will generate how many people are going to. But like Leighton Animal Hospital, I think that's a company name. That's why they're number six. They're still getting some uh, traffic to that website. And that is what I would say, or Mountain West Leighton even. Those are more buyer intent keywords because it has location attached to it. And so I did just go ahead and look up Pet MRI Leighton, Utah. Um, not a lot of things popped up, which isn't surprising, but Reyes Radiology did, which is cool. Um, even though this shows me latent. Oh, so you guys are right here. Cool. Um, so, I mean, that's a good thing that you are popping up for that. So, um, this is your Google business profile right here. And about 30 to 40% of the online traffic goes to, you know, they either click on the website or click on the click to call right here. So it is good that Reyes Radiology is there. The Mountain uh, Mountain West Veterinary Clinic, you know, they could be up here by adding more reviews. They could be putting their names into directories like uh, your name, address, and phone number into things like Yellow Pages and Yelp are beneficial because Google's kind of like a big popularity contest. By giving out your information to as many people as possible, they'll start to trust you more, and that'll rank you in uh, multiple locations as well. And then adding branded geotagged or geolocated photos weekly is really beneficial because it shows Google that you're growing your business organically. And then we move down into the organic listings, which Reyes Radiology right here is uh, number one. And then, you know, they're down here. So they're number four. So I don't know if there's, too, you said there wasn't too much competition for pet MRIs. Um, but I mean, you still could be moving up a little bit to be in number two for some of them for list but i did go ahead and look at reyes radiology and looking at this website there's a lot of content you know there's blogs there's a bunch of things which that's all great and just to kind of give you a quick glimpse you know 50 dr 21 ur 7,000 backlinks and you're getting 39,000 38,000 traffic to the website so i mean they're doing pretty well but as for what I would be doing for SEO, um, I don't know exactly. I'd have to get a little bit more specific for you. But like pet MRI, there's only 450 searches, and that's for like the whole entire country. 
So if we're looking to, you know, rank for these keywords, the fact that someone might be close enough to actually do that, probably not so great for SEO because it might be, you know, 50 states and, you know, if there's only 10 searches a month in each state, then, you know, the chances of us being close to them is pretty slim. So that's kind of what I would like to talk to you a little bit more on next time we meet. And we could go from there. Hope this is educational for you. And uh, like I said, so the biggest things that Google's looking for is um, content on your on your homepage and your whole website. And then you want to have good authoritative backlinks and citations. And uh, with those three things, those are really the main things that look, Google looks at for ranking websites. So hopefully that was helpful for you, and I'll talk to you soon.